Hey guys, and welcome to my Harry po Lego Harry Potter years one to four let's play on the DS. Yeah, I didn't see uh, many people doing let's plays of Harry Potter, except for this one guy. He's doing really good. He's doing uh, Wii and PS3. Actually, there might have been more than one person, but anyways, yeah, I didn't see any DSs, so I thought I'd you know go for it. Uh, this will be my first Let's Play, so I'm going to try my best. But, uh, yeah, this game is great. Um, just has loads of stuff in it. Uh, it goes really well with the Harry Potter movies and books. Um, yeah, this is my first mode, 96%. Um, it would have been 100, but I just wanted to start the Let's Play, and I didn't want to uh, wait all day. Try and figure out how to... Yeah. I've got everything in the game, I've got everything, but I just have to get cogs and buy, uh, uh, Voldemort and, Voldemort, like, yeah, Voldemort and uh, Dumbledore, I'll just leave it at that. But, yeah, here's a cutscene, so I'll just shut up for you guys. Yeah, yeah, that's awesome. It just follows so well with the movie and book. Well, maybe not the book for that part, but still. Um, yeah, and they add comedy to it. As you can see, Hagrid takes out half the lawns. Um, yeah, we gotta talk to Vernon because he wants us to do stuff. I have a job for you, boy. I need to help Dur Dudley find two of his presents. Yeah, what a stupid name, Dudley Dursley. Who would name their kid Dudley, honestly? I don't know. Uh, I don't know many Harrys either, but hey. You better find my presence, Harry. And then Dudley joins you, and I don't know for what reason, but hey. Don't argue with it. And Dudley's strong, so he can move this little box. Well, giant box. I don't even know if there's a box in the house. But yeah, I love this level. It's so... Uh, like, in, in any Harry Potter game I've played, I haven't been able to run around in privet drive number four privet drive um yeah up here Aunt Petunia will give the one of the presents and we got one of the presents in that room I forgot to mention um yeah you can't get anything in here until free play and that's basically at the end because you need to have Alahomora to unlock those doors but we won't be doing free play until after the story anyway so we don't have to worry about it um, Harry doesn't know any magic right now so he can't do anything but, you know, that's just part of the story. That's how it works. About time, too. Now give me, now give them to me. And then we give Dudley his damn presents. Um, the post should be here by now. Go and check for it. And then we get a new quest. Easy, a very easy quest. And then there's a new cutscene. at least chowing down. <laughs> what a pig. Funny part. <laughs> 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 
Yay! I love how everything's made out of Lego. It's so awesome. And we're at the Leaky Cauldron. A pub in London. Oh. There we go. Bless my soul, it's Harry Potter. Harry, could you do me a favor? Some of my customers have asked to meet you. Any chance you could say a quick hello to me? Sure I can, Tom. Okay. Yeah, this just shows you where the stuff is that you need to go. But, being a Lego game, you gotta pick up as many cogs as you can. Or you won't be able to go far. Uh, Doris Crockford, Mr. Potter, I can't believe I'm meeting you at last. Uh, uh, great to meet you, Doris. Um, do, do, do. Pick up some more cogs. Yeah, I'm gonna do this 100% um, if I haven't mentioned that. Yeah, I'm gonna try and do 100%. My last mode was 96 only because there's a couple things that I didn't buy, but those were because Dumbledore's 2,500,000 cogs and Voldemort's. Two million. And yeah, I didn't feel like waiting that long to do the let's play. Harry P P Potter, C can't tell you how pleased I am to meet you. Harry, this is Professor Quirrell. Quest complete. Well done, Harry. We'd best be getting along now. There we go. Yeah, I'm gonna try and keep the stylus out of the screen, but it's not hard, easy sometimes because sometimes you're moving over here and then you gotta, yeah, I gotta move my hand over here. Anyways, oh, stylus dropped. Anyways, uh, yeah, he says you gotta tap this and you gotta switch to Hagrid. Yes, I know Hagrid. Let me switch. There we go. And you just gotta tap. Like Simon. There we go. And then we get to see a little cool animation. And that is so awesome. Welcome, Harry, to Diagon Alley. And I look around while we have a look around while we wait for Gringotts to open. And yeah, you got a quest to do. There's this lady that lets her rats loose. Cause she's silly. Um, could you help me catch all my rats? They seem to have escaped. Okay, now we're gonna run over the rats. And the douche. Oh, they're so fast. Oh. Mm. Oh, let me run you over. Oh my god, they're not ever this annoying. Oh, okay, that's just a... I'd blame me looking through the camera as this, but this is just me not being able to catch these mice, rats, or whatever you want to call them. Take that. That's all of them. We should return to their owner. Thanks for the advice, Hagrid. Oh, well done. Now I just need to fix their cage. Well, I don't have any wands, so that's not possible. Hey, and I get a hat. A magical wizarding hat. I'll explain those later. Time to head to Gringotts, Harry. Yeah, anyways, um, yeah, this is the end of part one of my Let's Play. Uh, yeah, I'll continue on and eventually get to 100% hopefully so uh keep watching see you guys around